Hey YouTube, this is Robin Apps one here, and I'm here to do a review for Pan. So, Pan um, is uh, not a movie done by Disney. Um, this is Warner Brothers' uh, live-action take on the character. And this story really explores the origins of Peter Pan, um, and it explores a bit about his background um, with his mother. Um, it's set uh, during World War Two, actually, and um, the story basically sees Peter Pan um, going to Neverland after being kidnapped by pirates. And these pirates basically um, work for uh, Blackbeard, uh, played by Hugh Jackman. And basically, Hugh Jackman, Hugh, sorry, Hugh Jackman is um, basically trying to find um, per uh, pixie dust. Um, which is kind of hinted at as being, like, some kind of drug, um, or something. Um, and basically, Pan, basically, is the prophesied leader of the, uh, of the fairies. And has to basically go save the, uh, Go save Neverland. Um, okay, so I think, um, let's get this out the way. There was definitely a clear case of whitewashing. Um, a lot of characters that could have been played by, um, black actors or, um, or actors of different colour um, would have served this story better. Um, instead, we got a mainly white cast. Um, and although I don't like talking about race in movies, but it definitely was a bit of a problem. Because there was no, there was very, very little diversity, um, in this film. And a lot of what was shown was quite flat. Um, the acting, very, very flat. Um, this is, was clearly marketed towards children. Um, and there's not a lot of things for the adults. Um, the story, the story could have been done a lot, lot better. Um, and for instance, you could have made, um, Pan into a very, very interesting and compelling character, but still likeable for the children. Um, a thing that I kind of liked about this movie, though, was the exploration about um Pan's past. Um Yeah, I really, really like the exploration of Pan's past. Um and you know, sort of who his mother was, um and, and all of that stuff, um, it was actually really, you know, one of my favourite aspects about the film. Um, and I also think the child did do a good job. He was a lot better than the, than the adult actors, who kind of overplayed it a little bit. But guys, other than that... Oh, and I found Hugh Jackman's um, 
Blackbeard to be really, really ridiculous. Um, I'm not really set. I'm not really asking for a movie that can't be for children. But when you're thinking of live of live action films and films of about exploring the origins of a character, at least make it somewhat more interesting. If you want to go see a great film about Peter Pan, go watch the movie Peter Pan. Um, there is actually another live action version of Peter Pan and it's very, very worth watching. So go watch this one. Don't bother with this movie because it's not good.